first you need to gather all these documents to proceed with the visa processing for inside country which means inside UAE so this is applicable for those um, employees that is applying for employment visa and is currently inside UAE so first which is the most important thing is you have to have at least six month validity of your passport and you also need to have a degree or educational certificate or diploma and it must be attested in your home country as well as attested here in UAE from Ministry of Foreign Affairs. So some job titles does not require this degree such as um, office boy or receptionist or any administrative um, job titles. Aside from the degree, you also need to have a passport size colored photo and uh, um, so, so aside from that, you also need to have a signed offer letter from the company and this, these are the initial documents. So as we proceed with the process, um, you may need to submit like the medical certificate which says that you're medically fit and then you also need to provide your Emirates ID registration form and uh, of course the medical insurance which is now mandatory. Any representative, a representative from the company that, or from your employer must um, submit and launch an application in the DMCC portal. And you, you know, these uh, form must be filled with all your information. And then after that, all the requirements that I've mentioned earlier must be uploaded. And once that's uploaded, so the representative from your company will submit it. Once it's submitted, then DMCC as well as the immigration will verify and approve your application. So after the approval, um, the immigration will issue your entry permit. So once the entry permit is issued, the company representative will update your visa status on the DMCC portal. So it could be that uh, it will be changed to employment visa under your, this new company or if your visa has been cancelled so you also need to provide the cancellation paper from your previous company so once all of these things are uploaded and the visa status is updated then um, as what I've mentioned earlier you need to submit the secondary requirements so it means that the MCC will do the typing of your medical fitness um, paper as well as the Emirates ID um, ap application or registration form. So once these two documents are typed, so you can approach any uh, medical centers to do your medical fitness test. So usually they will take uh, your blood and x-ray. So once it's all good to go and you're medically fit, then you will get a medical certificate that you're fit. And then you can proceed now to go for the biometrics for Emirates ID. So on your scheduled appointment, you have to visit any government Emirates ID facility to do your fingerprinting. And they also need to require your original passport as well as the medical fitness uh, result that says you're medically fit. And they will stamp your registration form. So all of these things like your medical fit um, certificate and your medical insurance as well as your um, stamp Emirates ID form must be uploaded again to the DMCC portal by the company representative. So once that's uploaded, um, again DMCC and immigration will verify and approve. So once it's approved, then the immigration will proceed with the issuance of your um, residence visa. So they will stamp this residence visa on your passport. So basically, this is just the main steps of the MCC um, processing for visa.